Welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you how to make these Harry Potter themed candles. So all you're going to need is some blank paper, some white tissue paper, parchment paper, some candles, tape, scissors, and a blow dryer. Also if you want a curling iron or a straightening iron. The first thing you're going to do is cut out tissue paper so that it fits your white paper and tape it on. Next you're going to find the image that you want to print out. Make sure it's on a white background. Then print it out on your tissue paper so it ends up being printed like on the actual tissue paper itself. Don't mix it up and don't print it off on the other side. Then you're going to cut it out and then just leave it on the paper first so then it's easy, it just falls off once you're done. Next, take the one you're going to put on first, place it on top of your candle, and then place your parchment paper over it. Then use your blow dryer and heat it up for around 2 minutes, that's how long it took mine. But you can just do it in short periods of time and keep checking until the edges are pretty much sealed in it. Basically what's happening is the heat is melting some of the wax, and then the, um, the tissue paper is getting sealed inside the wax itself. But I didn't think it was sealed enough, so I did take my curling iron and just really quickly went over some of the edges, which worked instantly. And then you can just, you know, you can also wrap your um, curling iron in the parchment paper or just like wash it off like I did afterwards with some oil and stuff. So next, I'm, um, I'm actually just taking my pens and making the labels on the tissue paper myself instead of printing them out. But it's the same exact process. seal it I'm again just using my curling iron it works really quickly and really easy and this doesn't have to be Harry Potter theme it's just this is what I was making for my sister's birthday you can obviously make this anything you want the final thing I did is um, draw another symbol and just put it on top of my candles and just repeat the steps So this is the finished product and she really really liked them. By the way, I got my candles at um, TJ Maxx, no, I think actually Ross for like $2, it was really cheap and they smell really nice and it worked perfectly. So you can check out my other videos and I'll see you next time, bye guys!